I just found a chat GPT prompt that should be illegal. So obviously if we're using chat GPT, you need to go to their website right here and you can use any of these models. But for the prompt I'm about to show you, I prefer using either the 03, 04 or 04 mini high. Me personally, I found the best results with the 04 mini high for what I'm about to show you. Now here's where the secret comes in. I'm gonna upload a photo by clicking on this plus button then hit add photos and files. And I'm gonna upload this photo of me in Torrey Pines State Natural Reserve when I was in San Diego, California. And from here, I can ask ChatGPT, where was this picture taken? Give me approximate coordinates and a confidence rating. And when I hit submit, you can see right here, it's trying to analyze the image. And when it's done, it'll give you a location that it thinks that picture was taken at. So it says Torrey Pine State Park. It'll say why it picked that. So it says golden sandstone cliffs, some shallow tide pools. It even gives you other pictures of that location. So yeah, these look pretty similar. It's my approximate coordinates that I asked for. So let's see if it's right by highlighting it and searching on Google. And while I don't remember the exact place I took this picture at, I mean, that's pretty darn close. And it gives us a confidence rating right here of 60%. I'd say that's pretty good. And before you start commenting, oh, Maddie, Chad GPT just used the picture metadata and found out the location from that. First of all, I used a screenshot, so it doesn't have any. But just to prove that you're wrong, I went to this website that actually removes the XF metadata. Let's upload another photo here. This one is when I was on a Carnival Cruise at Half Moon K. So let's upload that. And we're going to download a clean image here. And we'll go straight back to Chad GPT using the same model we used before. Upload a photo. And we'll upload our clean photo of me at Half Moon K. And for this prompt, I'm going to change it up a little bit. I'm going to say, where was this picture taken? Give me coordinates and a confidence rating for different locations. Just in case it thinks there might be multiple locations that this could be possibly at and hit submit. And you can see it's evaluating some potential locations there. And let's find out what it says. Half Moon K at 45%. We got some other cruise line locations here like Princess K's, Royal Caribbean. But all in all, it did give the most confidence to Half Moon K where we were at. And it said it was based on the blue strap loungers that were on, Cabano style shelters, and some common features of a cruise line private island. And just see how accurate ChatGPT actually is because maybe you think, I told it beforehand where I was in those pictures. I'm gonna go to Google Maps right here. I'm gonna grab my guy in the bottom right. Let's snag him right here. And I'm gonna close my eyes and just drop him in the middle of the world somewhere. So let's do it right now. Yeah, right here sounds pretty good. You can see in the top left, obviously, it, we're in Leewarden, Friesland. I have no clue where that is, but I'm gonna open up my snipping tool and take a screenshot of just the surroundings, nothing with text in it. Let's go right there. We will copy that, then go right over to ChatGPT, paste our picture in there, and then give it the same exact prompt we just gave it for the previous one and hit enter. You can see it's analyzing the image right here. And for this one, it actually thought for two minutes and it gave us a reasoning behind it because it saw a Burritos Brothers logo. And the location it gave us was Kel. 27 lead warden with a confidence of 60 percent but we can actually fact check chat gpt here by copying the location so let's go with this we'll copy that and then go back to our maps and if we hit directions to the location we dropped on and for our starting point we're going to paste in the location that chat gpt gave us and hit enter we can see we're only three minutes away from the original location so i'd say that's pretty accurate